Hello everybody, welcome back to EU4. This is the, uh, what shall we call it, the campaign for Persia? Yeah, I don't know what we're gonna call it, but anyway, um, we are hanging on a, on a thin thread here. It's, um, Caucasia. Uh, we need the, um, the uh, alliance with the Ottomans. And um, we're pretty far from it, actually. Uh, nine points here. The thing is, we do have a Regency Council, and um, that's only one diplomatic skill. And but our leader, when he comes out, also only have one diplomatic skill, so that doesn't help. But our uh, diplomatic advisor died, and there's uh, doesn't seem seem to be anybody new uh, new ones coming in. So. What we're doing now is we are integrating Persia. And hopefully uh, the Timurids will leave us alone for the next uh, three and a half years until we're done with that. And uh, Karakoronius should move their uh, capital, but I guess it's because they're still at war. They're beating up on the Shema down here. Once they are at peace, they will move their capital out, out of this province, which I then can take. Yep, so there's that. Um, I can invest in military technology, which I think I will do. Military tactics, land morale, and I can build an armory. And I have lots of money, so why don't I just go ahead and do that? Still no statesman. That's the one I want. I can take a plus two guy if it is uh, necessary. Well, I should uh, keep relations up here while I don't have anything else to do. Let's keep that up to date. 25% uh, on annexing Persia. The question is, will they keep their course? That is a good question, actually. We'll see. 30% on integration. Still no uh, sign of the uh, Timurids. I guess they're busy with stuff. Unflux of unbelievers. Let's lose 25 piety. Maintain diplomat in the autos. Royal marriage is still way out. Yeah, I'm gonna need the uh, statesman for that. Ooh, statesman. I can't tell you how happy I am for that. Let's go back here and see. We can now royal marriage, so start relations improvement. Get the guy back home. And let's do a royal marriage. Okay, so that was the first step. That's still not an alliance though. To get the alliance, we are still seven points shy. So I guess now is the time to send the gift. I think it is. I can't do that until 29 September. Let the time pass by. There we go. Oh, that's not it. Okay. So, what we need to do is economy, send gift, full, full 25, it's gonna cost 275, a lot of money, but it's worth it. Send it away, 
and offer alliance minus one. Ooh, that was close. So, um, two things can happen. Um, we can get closer to them, or we can send some subsidies. Now, we will get closer to them automatically when we integrate Persia, which is in, uh, let's see, oh, we can't see that here. Uh, where do we see that? Maybe in here. Estimated to be done June 63. Oh, that's faster than I thought. So that's about um, uh, two years, less than two years. Well, we can chance it and uh, try and wait for that. Let's see, our king will be operational in, I think, six months. June 63. So when that happens, we will uh, be a lot closer to the Ottomans, and then we can get the alliance. So I'm actually very, um, I'm, a, I'm a bit excited about this, if it will work out. We should get a king uh, pretty soon. I think next month maybe, or the month uh, the month after that. Yeah, I think the uh, next month here. Oh, we got him here. Yeah, so five one four. You add to the throne with a very good diplomatic. Uh, how old is my heir? Ten. Okay, I, that shouldn't have changed anything. Let's go here and see. Um, no, but we can uh, we can get the improved relations back up a little bit. Let's go ahead and do that, just to keep it maxed out. We can also choose a rival, and that has to be Armenia. Okay, we can actually attack Armenia now if we want to. Uh, let, let's just wait a little bit with that. I got more things to worry about. Let's see. We can establish the Sheikh Ul Islam office. Which will give us a missionary strength. Yeah, why not? It's free. Okay, so we have a uh, little over a year. I, I don't... Whoops. Oh yeah, so... <laughs> don't give me a shock here. Maintain diplomat. Uh, let's see how far are we exactly. Currently at zero. That means we are pretty damn close. So what we could do is we could uh, send subsidies to them, just to get the last couple of points. I'm still a little bit confused about the um, the annexation. Here it says April '63. That's in one year. that really so? Well, I think we'll just wait that one year. I hope we can uh, keep it going for just one year. Gain 10 prestige or lose 25. Well, I will gain then. Just one lousy year and we will be... Um, once we get the Alliance, we will be cruising from that, that point on, that's for sure. Well, we might as well just uh, keep the window open, actually. Maybe we'll get a point from God knows what. Oh, they're already attacking Armenia. Well, maybe we will get some uh, opinion from uh, attacking the same country.
Oh, they're also at war with Georgia. Allied with Caucasia. I think we should jump on that bandwagon. At least we need this province to get the uh, everything uh, sorted out. Let's see if we can... Um, uh, then I need to go back to the Ottomans and get this guy back home. Oh, sorry. And there we go. And then go to Armenia. Declare the war. No castle's belly. Hmm. You know what? I think I'm gonna eat that. Because it's gonna take too long to get the claim and all that stuff. I mean, they're already occupied here by the Georgians. But not here, though. Okay, so let's uh, see how long would it take to get the claim. Of course, I can't claim that. Oh. I'll wait a little bit. Royal marriage offer from Kara Karunliu. Are you are you serious? Well, technically, I uh, only need one province from them. I only need this one, but I do need it, so I will not. I will not do that. I mean, the big enemy now is uh, definitely uh, the Timurids. That, uh, for some reason, have been uh, pretty quiet for a long time. Now, I'm six months away from annexing Persia. Which will probably give me um, the alliance with the Ottomans. Most definitely. Three months away. I don't know if you feel that is uh, exciting, but I do. Because this whole uh, campaign is depending on just this. A few more months. Maybe one or two max. There we go. Integrating Persia. And they lost all their cores. That's okay. I will um I will take Tabriz now, which is a, a Persian core. No, they didn't lose the cores. They're still there. Okay, no problem. Now the thing is I need um, I need to ally these guys. So it's minus sixteen now. Why is it suddenly minus sixteen? That's odd. That's odd. Before it was zero. Neutral attitude towards Tabaristan is minus 20. Hmm. See, there's no longer a um, distance modifier that's gone. We still got the royal marriage. Opinion is high.
minus 16, why is that? That doesn't make any sense, to me at least. Well, let's try and go to war with the same uh, the same uh, guy. So we can um, now we can put the claim in on what's it called here? This one here. And once that is done, what's our limit here? Oh, it hasn't uh, checked out. Let's see. Maybe a month have to pass. think maybe that is so. Army force limit 6. That's weird. Something weird is going on here. How can I have an army limit of 6? That, that doesn't make any sense either. And I'm making minus 9 because of that. Is that a bug or what? I'm, I'm, I'm confused. I'm really genuinely confused about that. Anyway, let's move our troops up here and up here. Do I need to uh, like restart the game or something? Another month has passed. And the money is really going out of the drain here. Yeah, that is really weird. I think I'm gonna put a break in soon and then I will... Um, I will simply shut down the game before I start it up again. So that is, uh, I got cores on all of this. That should give me manpower, no? The manpower is only 25. Okay, uh, local autonomy is pretty high. Maybe we should take that down a little bit here. Local autonomy down. So a little bit of unrest, but we got some main power. Let's do the same here. And here. And up here. What about these guys? Oh, that was a, that was a lot of it. I don't don't touch this one. So that puts us at uh, no. That didn't change anything either. What? I got a lot more manpower. Well, a lot more is not the right word, I guess. Hmm. Still, only six. That's not a lot. Okay, I'm gonna put a break in here, restart the game, and see if that uh, calculation uh, does anything. If not, then I'm simply gonna lose some of the troops. Um, well, I think it's the autonomy. Local manpower modifier fifty percent down. So it should have been like sixty four. Base fifty. And then we got the uh, manpower efficiency. What is that? Manpower efficiency is that also over here? No. Why is the manpower efficiency malus? that also from this? No. Hmm. It seems to be a, like a double penalty or something. In any case, I am uh, breaking here, and then I'll, I'll figure, it, figure it out for the next episode. Um, thank you so much for watching, everybody, and see you next time. Bye-bye.